In this lecture, you'll learn about the different centralized management products that are available from NetApp that help you with managing multiple distributed clusters spread across different locations. As I said at the introduction to the section, in this course, I'm going to focus on the command line interface and system manager. That's because they are tools that are built into your ONTAP cluster. Everybody has them available and really everybody uses them. The tools that I'm going to cover in this lecture are optional tools that are just used by some NetApp customers. So we're not going to really go into detail on these. I'm just going to give you an overview of them so that you're aware of what's available and what the different tools do. Okay, starting off with the on-command unified manager suite. There's three main packages in this suite, and the suite is designed for configuring and monitoring NetApp environments. So it's not used for monitoring storage systems from other vendors like Dell EMC or IBM. So the different packages in the suite. The main one that's really the central one that the other ones can revolve around is on-command unified manager. This provides capacity, inventory, and protection. Protection meaning high availability, snap mirror, and snap vault that we'll talk about later, monitoring. So on-command unified manager provides centralized monitoring. You can do monitoring with system manager as well, but if you're using system manager for your monitoring, then you have to go and check each system, each cluster one at a time, which is not as convenient as having one centralized pane of glass that you can use to monitor all your clusters at the same time. So if you've got unified manager and any of your clusters anywhere has a problem, this is a really convenient way to get alerted about that. Also, you, from here, you can drill down. You can see exactly what's going on with your distributed systems. So that was Unified Manager. The next package available in the Unified Manager suite is On Command Performance Manager. So with these three different packages, they each run on a different server. So software that you install, three of them on three different servers. So Performance Manager collects and reports on ONTAP performance, obviously. It has its own notification functionality. So you could run just Performance Manager on its own without Unified Manager, but typically you're going to have both of them running. So you're going to have Unified Manager, which does all your big global reporting and monitoring. You're going to have Performance Manager, which gives you your performance statistics, and Performance Manager is going to be integrated with Unified Manager. That allows you to see the statistics from Performance Manager in Unified Manager. If you only have Unified Manager without Performance Manager, you don't get those performance statistics. So very often you're going to want to have them both running and integrated with each other. The third one is Workflow Automation. This can be used to automate most tasks, including cloning, migrating, protection, and provisioning of your storage. Again, it can also be integrated with Unified Manager. So if you do have all three, you're going to integrate them with Unified Manager, and then you can use Unified Manager as your single pane of glass. What workflow automation allows you to do, pretty self-explanatory from the name, is for repetitive tasks, you can configure them as workflows. And then, so you do the, the work up front, and then later on, it's very easy for those repetitive tasks, you just run them as a workflow. A benefit you get from this, as well as the ease of use, is that it makes sure that those workflows are always going to be done in a standardized way. Okay, so that was Unified Manager. Moving on, we have got Insight, and Insight does a lot of the same jobs that that Unified Manager does. But where Unified Manager is for NetApp-only environments, Insight can be used for multi-vendor storage. So it can also monitor storage systems from those other vendors. So unlikely you would be using Insight and Unified Manager at the same time. More likely you would have one or the other. The different packages that are available with on-command Insight. First one we've got is Insight Assure. That delivers complete monitoring, risk detection, and compliance auditing for those complex multi-vendor environments. Insight Perform is a scalable solution for a broad view of performance data and resource optimization across those distributed systems. 
Insight Plan provides global visibility of asset utilization to simplify purchasing decisions. So this helps with your capacity planning. And Insight Discover offers a single platform that identifies your entire inventory and integrates all the on-command on Insight modules. So again, that's like your front end for Insight. Okay, next management package that we've got is Cloud Manager. And Cloud Manager is used to do the initial deployment of cloud volumes on tap on AWS or Azure. After that initial deployment, it can also be used for simple configuration, such as replication policies. So if you want to be moving data from the cloud to on-premise, for example, you can configure those relationships in Cloud Manager. But for your main granular management of cloud volumes on tap, we can use System Manager again for that. And the last one I'll cover here is Snap Center Backup Management. Again, these are all separate software products. Snap Center provides central management of application and operating system consistent backups, restores, and clones. So this is optional. Again, you don't have to use Snap Center, but Snap Center gives you centralized management of your backups. Client plugin software is available for your clients, Windows, Linux, Oracle, SQL, SAP HANA, Exchange, and VMware. And you can also build custom plugins for other applications as well. So what this is used for is when you do a backup, you don't want an application to be writing data at the time. For example, you see we had SQL Server here. You don't want SQL Server to be writing data at the time that you take the backup because that can lead to an inconsistent backup. When you use the plugin software, that works with Exchange to make sure that when the backup is taken, it's a consistent backup that is taken. And Snap Center integrates with ONTAP replication, so data can be moved throughout your data fabric. Thanks for watching. If you want to get hands-on practice with NetApp Storage for free on your laptop, then you can download my free ebook, which you can see above my head right now. Also check out my NetApp Storage Complete course, which will teach you everything you could possibly want to know about ONTAP. Thanks.